Well, welcome back to another episode, folks. Here I am again, back down on the River Stour in Suffolk. And uh, I've just dug some lugworm and I was in a mad rush to do it. Probably only got about two hours before high tide now. But um, just gonna get set up, two rods on flapper rigs, uh, size 1.0 hooks and uh, two up they are as well. So uh, small hooks, see if we can't pull out so now we can take some bass home as well. I really want to catch and cook one. Uh, that'd be delicious, if not a flounder, because we've been catching a few flounders on the river. I have been busy. I went to France the weekend before last and me and the missus managed to go out and do some fishing there on uh, Boulogne sur mer uh, Pier and uh, that was good fun and then last weekend, well I just got back uh, yesterday from Cornwall but the weather, the last couple of weeks has been dead against us wind, rain, everything so I was just looking for an excuse uh, after work to come down here now the clocks have gone forward and uh, see if we can't get something on the river well, both of those rods have been out for about uh, about 20 minutes. I'm going to bring them in. Uh, there's a lot of weed and it's attached to rocks. So uh, the last thing I need to do is lose some gear because I've lost absolutely tons over fishing in Cornwall and uh, France. Um, probably because I'm used to fishing the way I do here and uh, not fishing in the correct way there. Yep. As I thought, a ton of weed. But uh, yeah, I wasn't really happy with those first two casts anyway, so I wanted to get out a bit further. Again, we pull this lot in. Stones on the bottom. But keep on going. About half an hour before high tide. Come on, please. Definitely a lot of weed on it. This is masses of weed. But we have got a fish. <laughs> smallest bass it is the world's smallest bass but fish is a fish right where well, the wind has switched round and uh, literally immediately it's gone and now it's coming that way so uh, the bivy just blew away actually <laughs> it's quite funny trying to do that on my own but uh, yeah had that little one it's not going like I sort of planned it so uh, rolled out uh, France footage and then um, later on we'll have a snippet of that Cornwall footage for now it's just that one little bass but you never, you never know come on Side of the road, yeah, it's you're pissing down. Remember, you're just overtaking everybody. Oh, yeah, I can do that. Let's go. <laughs> oh, mate, it's not exactly fishing weather, is it? Well, unfortunately, I think uh, the weather might be against us for a bit of fishing. Doesn't look great, does it? <laughs> Let's get pissed. Yeah. Right, another windy day. Stops fishing at Wissant. That could be the title of this video. <laughs> no fishing at Wissant. But we found a little place at Boulogne off a pier, so we're gonna go and check that out instead. Apparently it's less windy, but we'll yeah. find out when we get there. It's still about 15 mile an hour wind, and then on a the pier I think it might be a bit more, but we'll give it a go. We'll see how it goes. We've had a great time. I uh, had lots of malls last night in the restaurant over there. It's lovely, Fantastic. wasn't it? So, uh, yeah. Great little uh, birthday trip. Thank you very much. You're very welcome.
But uh, let's see if we can catch a fish. Yeah. Oh, we need the bait. Oh yeah, don't forget the bait. <laughs> yeah, don't leave it in there for the for the landlord. <laughs> until uh, until then, we're gonna hit the road and uh, say goodbye to Bissan and uh, see what it's like in Beloit. Bit of sunshine. Right, two hook flapper, size one o hooks, and some lugworm we bought from the local angling shop. Trying to work out every single local angler has just left. Gone. Just left. And the ones over there on the other side, they've got they've gone. All of these guys are going. They all just left at the same time. We're well, just gone, aren't they? Strange. What's so going on? we're not sure what's going on. <laughs> but hopefully they were just in a match and that's the match over. But uh we're gonna carry on until we're turfed off or arrested. Yeah. Maybe not allowed to fish at a certain time, but. 12 on a Sunday. Yeah, maybe. We're going to carry on now. It is windy. Could be getting a few taps. Could be. Whiting. Whiting. Hey. Little whiting, first fish in France. Had to be, didn't it? Greedy bugger. Greedy little <laughs> bugger. First little fish. Woohoo! Hooray! Finally, we got fishing after all of this time. Here we go. Yeah. Another, Another little, little one. Here's a small one, but if I put him up to the camera, yeah, look how big look he is. <laughs> hey! Two fish in France. Yeah, you had a bite there, mate. We've come right to the end of the pier. That was quick, I've only just passed it. A bit white. Yeah, you got a whiten. Probably the whiten of the day, mate. Hooray! Queen of the whiten, she strikes nice. again. For me. Well yeah. done. We just moved further up the pier because obviously the tide's going out. Yeah, the tide has shot right out from the beach. Beautiful beach here in Boulogne. But uh, straight away, you're in. Considering packing it up, and Vicky had a fairly decent bite there, although it is quite a sensitive rod. Yeah, you got one. That is whiting of the day, I reckon. Oh, Don't drop him now. That is whiting of the day. Well done. Well, I might have one last cast as well. Nothing, but let's hit the road. Well, been good in France. Lovely uh, weather today. Bit yep. windy, but sun's been out. It's actually got some heat in it. It's yeah. Been really nice. Had a great birthday. Had some great food last night. Some Moules Marinere in the local restaurant. It was great. And uh, yeah, good times. Back to England. Back to England. Back to work tomorrow. Oh, for sad times. Bollocks. <laughs> Until next time. Something it is. Holy shit, I've got a bite. I've got a bite. Go. Go. Got the biggest club of weed I've ever seen. Fucking hell. Nothing. God damn! 
conditions aren't the best. I reckon we'll roll that Cornwall footage on and uh, at least you can see me catching a fish. Unless you ain't got a line in the water though. So here we go, finally on another fishing adventure. This time we are in Cornwall, Stan was in Grey Friends and uh, uh, Pendine and we are on our way to the beach for a spot of beach fishing. Cheers Ruth, what do you reckon about that? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be on camera. <laughs> Got to catch a fish today. Crazy. That's the spot. We're going to set up just here. But uh, maybe walk out there a little bit, chuck some lines out. And yeah. I'm really hoping we're going to catch something. Let's get down there. Two hook flapper. Yep. Gonna give it a try. Yeah, let's go for it. Good man. Yeah, let's catch some of it. I'm not gonna try not to break my fleeting ankles, to be fair. Let's do it. Bit kelpie, bit snaggy. Come on, we want something, we want something. Good time though, beautiful weather in Cornwall. They didn't forecast this, that's for sure. Whew. Good to be out fishing. Even if it's not a bit snaggy. There's some sunshine. Actually, it's fine. But I had a fuss with a retriever. Yeah, it's all down snags as well. Come on. Oh, man, we have to make a big jump on it. Yeah, go on. Oh my word! Yes, Look at the colours on that balanrass. Oh my word! Go from the bottom, I think. Look at the colours on that. It's kind of what we came for, to be fair. That's target number one. Hopefully, that camera can pick it up. Gorgeous fish. Jeez Louise, Nick. It's worth it. Every inch of it. <laughs> so, day two, round two. This time we're going to go a bit further than uh, we were yesterday off the rocks and uh, fish it from the beach. Bigger baits, squid, peeler crab, uh, maybe a two-hook flapper with some uh, ragworm on it as well. But yeah, let's get down there. Bit of a high K, Rosie. Look how blue that sea is. Oh yeah, beautiful. This rock faces. Insanity. Talking of insanity. <laughs> Let's get some rod tail. Bit of a rain shower there, weren't there? Soft in the way, but good. Yeah, <laughs> bit wet. I mean, those clouds are ominous. But the scenery out here is just rugged. I mean, it's, it's crazy. Beautiful, right? It's still good, it's still warm. So rig-wise, Nick, Nick's got the right hand rod, the blue one there, um, and you've got a big old pulley rig on there, size 4 hooks, and uh, a whole squid on it. Yeah. Hoping for something bigger. Yeah, hopefully, pick up a nice ray or something. Yeah, a nice ray, blonde ray, something like that. I've got, on this Conaflex, a shorter one, I have got a two-hook flapper with ragworm from yesterday. Hoping to pick up anything on a species. And Vicky on a little scratching rod. She has got a two-hook flapper and a, a small gripper weight as well, so... See if I can cast it. There might be some bass out there in amongst that surf, so... I ain't gonna cast over these waves, am I? No. <laughs> <laughs> Could have a little nibble.
Yeah, we got one. You we got, got one. Second fish. Everyone gets spiked. There you go. Yeah. A little bar of Cornish silver. Right, that's so it's uh, gonna call it. Day two has been great. We're going to get some lunch, and uh, hopefully on a long walk back, it's not gonna rain again. But I'm wet enough as it is, so it doesn't matter. Down along the creeks, I'll be where the rivers meet But over on the other side, round by the open sea So if you need me, you know where I'll be The child that ghost of me is sitting by the water's edge Dreaming that I could be swimming with what I hope to catch Said it now, I'm thinking back of where the time has gone But not a single ounce of doubt, I'm right where I belong So if you need me, you know where I'll be I think something might be playing with that one Sail it, let's have a look at that Let's have a look at that Come on, be something yeah, we got something, we got something. That's a decent size of jumping out of the water. Come on, come on! Come on, baby! Oh, yeah, oh, hell yeah, that's PB Bass. Look at that. That is perseverance, baby. Holy moly. He's unhooked already. I'm just gonna get a measure on him. Cause he's too big to take. Like that is a big breeding fish. Like I wouldn't want to take something that big. He is 60. He's dead on 60. That's a PV bass. He is massive. Boom. Washed him off. Now that is a big fish. Gonna put him straight back. Too big for me to take. Are you ready? Here we go. There he goes. Woo. Oh my God, what rush. Perseverance. That is a big fish. Oh man. That is a big fish. Not a bad size schoolie, but the weed is just meant to. But, lovely little bass one, so get back. That rod moved all of its own accord just then. And then suddenly it's moving, it's going, it's going. At last cast as well. See the drift? I really hope that's not just weed. 
my computer a bit of a better angle. Place them down a bit, things like that. I just love these fighting bands because they will just splash out of the water. I'm not sure if he'll be 42, probably just under, I reckon, so we'll just get him back, I think. Yeah. Come with me. Got plenty of fight in him. Yeah, I don't know to be quite a session. I think that's me going to call it. I'm absolutely exhausted. Driven about one and a half thousand miles in the last couple of weekends. So uh, I reckon that'll be it for me. Until next time. You know where I'll be.